Hello, good evening guys. This is Gene from Pinoy Woodworking and DIY channel. And tonight I'm going to talk about my cordless tools. I'm going to show you what I like about them and what I don't like about them. And if I would recommend them to you guys. All right, so let's start first with the workhorse of my workshop. It's my DeWalt 20 volt max cordless drill. Uh, the model number here is DCD985, one half 13 millimeter cordless hammer drill. So this is the work. This is the uh, workhorse of my shop. Like I said, and I I'm using this every day. It's a very powerful drill. What I like about it is that it's powerful, and it can hold almost all of the size bits that I have because of the 13 millimeter chuck. It's got a steel chuck, which I really like because uh, it's more durable than the plastic chuck. And it's got this very nice and soft uh, ridges here. So when you hold it, uh, it's not, uh, you know, it, it doesn't hurt your hand. And it's got a hammer function and a drill and a 21 setting clutch. And it's got three speeds. One, two, three. So... Those are the things that I like about this drill. Yes, it's just uh, it's it just so durable and uh, so versatile. Uh, the things that I don't like about this drill is the weight. It's heavy. <laughs> it's just too heavy for me. Well, actually, it's okay. The weight is tolerable, but um, yeah, it's a bit heavy. And another thing is that um, there's a problem with the Dewalt. Uh, drills i think they have a problem with the with this chuck uh i think it's the sensor inside there's a there's something wrong with it because sometimes when you're drilling holes the the chuck system releases the bit it just releases the bit so i think there's uh, i i've checked on youtube on what's the problem and i i think that there's a problem with the locking system inside and that's uh that's it all uh dewalt systems it could get very annoying, especially if you're drilling holes and then uh, some, and then your bit got stuck on the, your material, and that's really annoying. So that's what I don't like about this drill. And the partner of this drill is the impact driver. Here it is. This is the impact driver, 20 volt max, and it's model number DCF885, one fourth six millimeter cordless impact driver i also like this thing this is made in us this one is made in mexico and they share the same batteries so yeah i like this one this is my favorite um, screw it got it, it it's got three led lights there so this can really do the job it can uh, sink the screws very easily and that's what i like about it what i don't like about it is that sometimes it's just too powerful so sometimes uh, when I use, uh, for example, a, a very weak uh, screw head like this one, a cheap screw head, it just uh, destroys the, the head of the screw. So I use uh, more expensive ones like the DeWalt uh, screw heads like this one so that would not happen and so it, so it would not slip. So that's the only problem that I have with this uh, tool. But these two, these are winning combinations. If you manage to get uh, to find one at a good price, buy them. They would last a long, long time, yes. Okay, so that's my DeWalt uh, cordless system. Now let me show you the next cordless system that I have. It's my Black & Decker Matrix. What the best thing about the Matrix is that you can change the head. So for example, you can remove the head like that and put other accessories i have here the trim saw which i love so much there you go there so i love that uh, trim saw because it's small but it's powerful it can cut through three, three port marine plywood with no problem at all so this one is 20 volt lithium so it's quite powerful yes so it just runs a minute Look, look like that and it has other attachments as well like uh, 
jigsaw, sanders, I think there's even a router. I'm not really sure, but I don't have those attachments. I only have the drill and the uh, trim saw, but this one is really good. This is my Fast and Furious saw, <laughs> okay. Now, uh, those are the things that I like. I also like that it's lightweight and the handle is ergonomic, so it's very comfortable on your hand. What I don't like is that the trim saw, it's not adjustable. It's only one inch and it's not adjustable. So I could not use it to make uh, dados or rabbits like that. And the drill, the chuck is plastic and it's sharp plastic right here. So I just uh, sand this thing because if I, uh, if I did not sand it, it's, it could hurt my hand because uh, the, the ridges are very sharp. So I don't like that. And for me, uh, it's a bit slow. It's slower than the than my Dewalt, but I like it because uh, it's okay. It's nice for, for uh, uh, it's nice for uh, precision work. Yes, because I can turn it really really slow. All right, so that's my Black and Decker Matrix system. And the next one that I have is the worst <laughs> drill in my system that's the craftsman c3 it's not worse because of the drill it's the worst because of the battery uh this is nicad battery it's not it's not lithium ion um my father gave me this drill and it's from the united states and he gave me three with a nicad not a uh, not uh lithium ion so this doesn't work uh, at all <laughs> the battery doesn't work it doesn't uh it just lacks, lacks power, you know. Uh, if this has a lithium battery, I think this would this would be a really good uh, tool. But because of the battery, mm, not not good. So if you have the chance to buy a C3 drill, get one with a lithium battery, that would last long. Uh, the good thing is that this is a nice drill. It it's perfectly shaped, and it's got this really comfortable chuck, but it's plastic, soft plastic. But I think that that's uh, also okay. And it comes with this combination uh, trim saw. So the battery here could fit here. And this would only last for like five minutes <laughs> using this one. So I would just cut uh, maybe two, three pieces of wood and it will just die. So I need, uh, I really need a lithium ion for this. But this one is a good saw because it's adjustable. It's got a bigger blade than the matrix system and it's adjustable. So I can make dados and other things using this uh, trim saw if I have the right batteries for it. But as of now, I don't have one. Um, I asked my mom to buy me lithium batteries for this Scrapsman and I hope that she would buy me one and yes maybe in the future i can use this more effectively all right so that's it those are my systems i got the craftsman and the black and decker matrix and of course my favorite the dewalt so those are my uh, cordless uh, drills if you ask me which one is my favorite i would still pick the dewalt it's heavy and the uh, chuck lock system is wonky sometimes but for its power and its uh, speed, it's still the winner. It's still the winner for our, for this uh, cordless tools uh, things right here. All right, so thank you so much, uh, guys. Uh, next time, I'm going to show you my corded tools and my big machines as well. So that's it. This is, again, this is Gene from Pinoy Woodworking and DIY channel. I'll see you again next time. Bye.